Welcome back everybody once again to Fallen Paradise by Gizmo. I am TJ the Obscure here with you. The music is working this time around. Hopefully it's at a reasonable volume. Last episode we died there at the very end to one of the special cartographer mobs. But we're going to give it another shot. And hopefully not die again. That is the plan. And I'll probably be editing some stuff out. Just so it doesn't get too repetitive, but I will be sure to include all of the highlights. I don't think I saw these arrows last time. I, you know, the whole items on the ground thing is really cool. But boy, I feel like I'm just constantly missing them. And maybe that's just me. Maybe that's just because I lack of the observation skills. I gotta check behind it now. I'm surprised I didn't do that last time. Okay, there is nothing there. Huh. Is there other redstone around that I just didn't see? Or was that maybe just a mistake of some kind? Who knows? Let's get the torches going and let's get on the road. Once again. Be try it. I'm gonna try to be a bit more careful about uh, getting hit this time. Try to avoid it as best as we can. All right, we did it right that time. I guess there's redstone over here, so yeah, it's just decorative, just to fit in with the color scheme of the area. I'm sure. I kind of forget what was over there. I know that there's items to be had. Alright, next up are the spiders. Which may or may not come after me. There we, there we go. Ashen Crawler. Come and meet your demise. What did he drop? Sharp Chitin. Spider Eye. Where are you going, guy? What are you doing? Gosh, sometimes their AI seems so very broken. Well, we made it much farther this time without taking any damage. And I'll probably start to get careless right about now. I kind of wonder if it doesn't even matter, like, which direction we take. And we're going to end up at the same place no matter what, or if we actually do have to go... ...down both paths. Probably grab some more wood here. You're wood too, aren't you? Uh, yes. We will put that right there. Once again, I I couldn't really figure out how the ability works, but uh, something tells me that little particle effect is maybe where we get teleported if we die. It's like our spawn point. Basically, is what I'm thinking. Was it just the one? Thought two of you had spawned. Oh gosh. Okay. We're okay. That skeleton head there had me nervous. I was thinking that it was an actual skeleton. More you guys, huh? Are you one of the scary ones? No, you're just the Scorch Miner. We gotta watch out for the ones with the cartographer effects. And basically, every time we see one, <laughs> just um, run far, far away, I guess, is the best strategy. Until we can better figure out their... Oh, gosh. Whoa, okay. Okay. I was not expecting full health blaze. Um, something tells me he may not want us to be going this direction. I do have the string to make a bow. And why I have not made one, I do not know. I do not know. But we got one now, which means Mr. Blaze can say goodbye. Maybe. Perhaps. Where did he go? 
Hey, guy, come back. Where are you? Hopefully he didn't, like, despawn or something. I'm pretty sure I spawned something... Back over here. But maybe not... What, did I kill the blaze? Or maybe they have, like, wither or something and they just die after a certain amount of time? And so that definitely looks like a trap. And it was actually a trapid trap. A trapity trap trap. With just a stick, it's the best stick in what? Best stick in the map. <laughs> kind of looks like there might be something over there. Let's just waste all of our gravel blocks. I want to see if there's like anything hiding back over here. No? No false walls or anything. Right, did it go off in this direction? Yes, it did. Guessing it's going to be a similar little offshoot as the last one. We have some lapis. I'm down two hearts. Oh gosh, I did not see you there, guy. Go ahead. Oh, almost forgot about the other spawner. Burnt Rock. This section of the caves was a mining zone. The crystal veins were mined to be turned into pure magic. Now those crystals have been corrupted. What horrible thing could have caused this? There's our burnt chest plate. We're going to have to go ahead and use that, I think. And put that guy on. Oh, more bread. Is that an actual piece of cobble? It is indeed, and some coal for us. Okay, well that wasn't too bad. Is it... I think it... Okay, that's not going to work. But let's just go ahead and <laughs> close that up, just in case. I can't mine that, right? I need stone, I think. So we'll just leave that there for now. Uh, maybe I'm mistaken and we can use a wood pick. But as far as I know, you can't. Are you going to be more blaze? Nope. Was it just you or you got a buddy over there? random pieces of leather hanging out on the side here. You're one of the bad guys, aren't you? I think so. So we run. We run when we see the bad guys. He was carrying the axe, and I'm pretty sure the one that killed us last episode was also carrying an axe, so that's what I'm basing my analysis on. Where did he go? Come back, guy. You terrify me. I don't know what you do, but it really seemed to hurt last time. I think that's you up there, yes? Flame Nova has been discovered. Let's see here. The enemy can release a burst of flames around it, dealing damage and setting players on fire. That seemed to be a pretty big area of effect. I feel like I was... Seven or eight blocks away, maybe? Did he drop anything cool? He dropped some pantalones. Do they have cracked versions of the nether brick now? Wow. Things are getting fancy, aren't they? I don't have any other healing items, do I? Uh, let's make some more torches. And keep an eye out for any more items hanging out on the sides of walls or anything. Oh, you guys are coming at me from two different directions. This is not cool. And your friend just kind of forgot about you there for a second. Yeah, something tells me this is all going to kind of wrap in and around on itself. And... 
that if we go that way, it's going to take us to the other place that we died last time. So we probably want to head right here is my guess. I really don't want fire aspect on my sword. No, thank you. That's a good way to get ourselves killed via fire damage via an inflamed zombie is what we will call them. Okay. What did we get? Slowness. Well, that's not too bad. Pretty sure I saw the zombie. Or not the zombie, the creeper, I mean. But now, now I'm not... There he is. No, I wanted you to explode. Fantabulous. Oh, this slowness is really not cool, man. Oh no, this is taking us to where we saw it go up. So maybe actually we do want to go left then. Or I almost feel like that would just wrap back down on the cavern that we were just in. Aw, oh, man. Uh, can we get over there? I don't think I have any good solid blocks yet, do I? I guess this is a good time to mine some then. Alright, blaze spawner down. We got ourselves another healing item. Which uh, does four. Huh. Let's go back and see where this other direction takes us. It's like I'm pretty sure it went off in this way. I'd rather not waste my arrows on you guys. goes that axe. I need to switch to my better pickaxe. And yeah, like I said, it looks like it probably just kind of goes back down to where we've already been. Because I see light down below, but I do see a pickaxe. Does it go up right here? No. No, right? Okay. Spiders. All right, let's take out the zombie spawner first. And then we got to figure out where this spawner actually is. Aw, oh, man. Oh, gosh. Okay. I shouldn't have done that. Uh, what is it? Efficiency 1. I'm breaking 1. Fortune 2. Now is probably a good time to go ahead and take the elixir there. And yeah, sure, I guess we can put a speed potion there. I'm not sure why we, we would want it there, but why not? Where you at, Mr. Skeleton? Uh, nope, we gotta shift, shift, shift. Reach, reach, reach. I thought that was... Um, what are those called? <laughs> Observation blocks? No. Observer blocks. Close enough, right? This looks like it's probably leading us to a new area, actually. Since I'm... Getting arrows from you guys for the most part. Like I'm pretty sure we've now spawned guys to our left over there. Can we get by without disturbing our blaze friends? Yes, we can. Although the zombies are coming for us. Go, go, go. Maybe, perhaps. Oh gosh, we actually made it through somehow. 
Uh, Gateway of Paradise. Fantastic. Does that do something? Does that stop them from coming? No, they're still coming. Okay. I was thinking, like, maybe there's some kind of protective barrier around this, especially with the spawners so close by. We're going up here. Goodbye, Mr. Zombie. Okay. Oh, man, you scared me. You scared me, text thing, whatever you are. Okay. Uh, there's a repair station, just like from Divinity Zen. There's some lapis here. We got chests with actual goodies. Maybe some health items? Nope, no health items. And then all of that lovely, lovely stuff. We don't have any of the objectives yet, but that's okay. We have made it to a safe area. And that means we're doing better than we did last time. Anyways, you guys, I think that's going to be it for me for today. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time.